Hi everyone and welcome to Pick a Card Tarot. Today we are going to talk about one of the most basic and important concepts in the tarot world. This is going to be different for each sign and everyone has a different interpretation, even if it seems not to be the same. Let's introduce you to the elements of each sign and how they strongly influence the personality of each of us. Looking to understand astrology better? It's a great idea to start with comprehending the four elements, air, fire, water, and earth. The 12 zodiac signs each have their own distinctive take on life, although signs that are associated with the same elements share similar outlooks and are reflections of one another in terms of their values and way of living. You may better understand your own personality and aspirations, as well as which signs you get along with the most, by knowing which element rules your sign. Air signs are irregular and vary at times, yet they are always related. They frequently have large social networks and a natural drive to acquire and impart information. They are kind and knowledgeable about research. Their ideas, which are frequently futuristic, humane, and progressive, tend to be effectively expressed and disseminated. They tend to perform best, though, if they have a clear purpose in sight because of how much their mental activity and lightness might interfere with their ability to keep their feet on the ground. First, it should be made clear that all elements have their good and bad points. What astrology seeks is that you are the one who can better interpret their attitudes that many times we do not understand but have been there since our birth. Once this is clear, we are going to move on to one of the strongest water elements and one of our favorites, Lagra. So please watch the whole video. We are going to show you a lot about how the water element influences Libra. And at the end of the video, we are going to talk about what are those signs that Libra doesn't usually get along with and which are the signs with which Libra has the best relationship with. Libras are considerate, courteous, and willing to constantly put others before themselves. They value harmony in all of its expressions. Libra is ruled by Venus, the star of beauty, and is preoccupied with looking well. Being able to view things from all sides, Libra is the master of diplomacy and compromise. She is adept at establishing deals and serving as a mediator in disputes. Relationships are important to this sign, and it is often happiest when surrounded by a large, trustworthy circle of friends, family, and co-workers. Libra, an air sign who is frequently up in the clouds, is excellent at coming up with big ideas but struggles to see them through. Working with meticulous signs like Virgos or Capricorns, particularly at business, may assist Libras achieve their goals. Though their imagination is one of their greatest assets, and they commonly utilize it to pursue careers in the arts or literature, don't judge Librans for daydreaming, because one of their greatest strengths is their creativity and they frequently use it to pursue jobs in the arts or in writing. The signs that share the same element are the most compatible egg two water signs like Scorpio and Cancer. This holds true for the two air signs in particular because they both take the initiative and have sharp minds. Because the two elements complement one another, air and fire have always worked well together. The two signs are similar in that they are both independent, quick, social, and free-spirited. Similar to how opposites attract, Libra and Aries frequently get along because of their mutual drive to dream large, see and be seen, and pave the way. However, an Aries who seeks confrontation may also be the worst nightmare of a Libra who values serenity. In comparison to the logical Earth sign Capricorn and the intensely sentimental water sign Cancer, Libra is square, the most difficult angle that can exist between two signs. Thank you for watching the whole video and wanting to learn more about your environment or about yourselves. Please subscribe and like for continue the spiritual path.